Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows an empty gas station sack in a pregnancy of about six weeks, two days. You can see the urinary bladder, uterus, cervix, and the empty gas station sack. An embryo is usually seen within the gas station sack by six weeks of gestation. One of the more common types of miscarriages known as an embryonic pregnancy for empty sac or blighting, blighted ovum happens when a gestation sac doesn't contain an embryo. In other words, an embryo fails to develop. What is blighted ovum? A blighted ovum is a fertilized egg that implants itself in the uterus but doesn't become an embryo. The placenta and the embryonic sac form but remains empty. There is no growing baby. You can see the gestation sac. There is no product of conception seen in the gestation sac. The gestation sac is empty. Pregnancy or empty sac is when the pregnancy stopped growing before the fetus developed. Using the watch and wait option, this type of miscarriage will pass on its own only 66% of the times and may take many weeks. Using mesoprostol, the tissue passes about 80% of the time within one week. The gestation sac may be recognized as early as four weeks and one day from the last menstrual period and should always be seen after four weeks and four days. Its diameter when first seen is about two millimeter and the normal sac increases in size to measure five to six millimeter at five weeks. Again, you can see in the transverse section, the uterus having a gestation sac without any fetal pole or yolk sac or product of conception in its interior. An empty sac pregnancy may also be referred to as an embryonic pregnancy or a blighted ovum, a term that is considered to be outdated. An empty sac pregnancy is a type of miscarriage even though the products of conception are still contained inside the uterus. Again you can see the gestation sac having no product of conception. Between five and a half to six and a half weeks, a fetal pole or even a fetal heartbeat may be detected by ultrasound, especially the vaginal ultrasound. The fetal pole is the first visible sign of developing embryo. If the, a vaginal ultrasound is done and no fetal pole or cardiac activity is seen, another ultrasound scan should be done in three to seven days. A blighted ovum causes about one out of two miscarriages in the first trimester of pregnancy. A miscarriage is when a pregnancy ends on its own within the first 20 weeks. When a woman becomes pregnant, the fertilized eggs attached to the uterine wall at about five to six weeks of pregnancy and embryo should be present. Now, the determining the viability, using an ultrasound, a pregnancy may be declared non-viable based on the following definite, definitive criteria. If a gestation sac without a yolk sac is observed 
in a scan but two or more weeks later there is no embryo within with a heartbeat meaning the pregnancy stopped progressing a fetal heartbeat may be may first be detected by a vaginal ultrasound as early as 5 and a half to 6 weeks after gestation that is when a fetal pole the first visible sign of developing embryo can sometimes be seen but before 6 and a half to 7 and a half weeks after gestation a heartbeat can be better assessed so you can see the gestation sac again you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button thanks